Is that how you put your shirt on? <laughs> Say hi. Say hi, guys. Hi. <laughs> Leon has a little messy face because he just had breakfast, didn't you? Yeah, it was yummy breakfast. Leon's just like, oh my god. <laughs> he just likes to look at himself in the viewfinder. This morning, early, early this morning, it was like 6:30, right, or something when you left. 6:30. Yeah. Yeah, John left the house at about 6.30 because he had to go to the grocery store. And he said there was like already a line. And the grocery store doesn't open until 7. And apparently it was a little bit crazy. Um, he did say he recorded some footage, so I'll show you guys that right now. Okay guys, well we are pretty much out of all of our supplies. So I have to go to Walmart. We're only gonna buy a week's worth of stuff because we're hoping that this calms down a little bit. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but like the parking lot's already halfway full and people are already going nuts. So, all right. All right guys, so I'm back in the car and you wouldn't believe like everybody was standing like six feet away from each other they were trying to buy everything and i mean everything like they bought all the cream cheese they bought all the snickers ice cream bars like there wasn't a stick of ice cream in that place and it's like why are you buying out all the ice cream i don't understand it i don't understand it at all um it was back-to-back -back war just for me to get you know i got a week and a half of food i'm gonna try to stretch it a week and a half but and then you guys got to think, just as long as it took me to get in the car, this is the parking lot now. So everybody that could come to the grocery store is here. So, so much for social distancing, you know. And they're saying it's been like this every day. So every single day, people are here fighting over supplies like no more is coming. It's just out of control. All right, guys, so I'm here at the post office. There's only one other person here. It's completely dead. There's some traffic behind me, but I think that that's all essential staff. Um, so, yeah. All right, now I'm back. So let me just show you a little taste of the mail we had. Except for the candy bar. I needed that after going to Kroger's in the post office. I just needed to sit and have a little bit of chocolate because, man, it is insane out there. Please, if you can, please stay home. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> so, yeah, that is what John dealt with this morning at the grocery store. <laughs> what is so funny? <laughs> You're a silly boy. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Are you crazy? Are you crazy, boy? <laughs> okay, anyways, um, and when he got back, he like took a shower, washed his hands, we wiped all the food and stuff off, everything like that. But now we are starting our day, right? Yeah. Oh, and if you guys are wondering why our lighting is so dark right now, well, that's because we have no power. The whole street doesn't have power. Um, I don't know what's going on. It just went out about 10 minutes ago. But hopefully they get it back up soon because it's already starting to get hot. So we'll see what happens. Okay, Mr. Messy Face, do you want to get dressed for the day? Your hair is a mess. Your face is a mess. You're still in your little jammies. Let's get you ready, okay? Here, you want to brush your TVs? You brush them. You brush. You do it. There you go. Good job, buddy. Is that how you put your shirt on? <laughs> You're taking it back off. Put it on. <laughs> You're silly. <laughs> uh, Leon. <laughs> Here, put it on like this. Put it on. <laughs> look, look, look. <laughs> Let me show you. Look, right here. Almost, see? Pull it down. No, don't take it off. There. 
There you go, Mr. Leon. You're all fresh and clean, ready for the day. Something that you guys haven't seen in a while, Leon's braces. He has them on and he's actually happy about it. That's kind of why I haven't been showing them for a long time is because he just gets so upset when he wears them and I really don't like to show him when he's upset. Um, he has been wearing them every day for about an hour a day and now he's tolerating them so hopefully we can work up to like an hour and a half to two hours. The ultimate goal is for him to wear them for half of the waking day. So like if he's awake for 12 hours a day, they want him to have them on for six. But we're not there yet. Thankfully he is making progress and he's happy with them on, which is great. Oh, <laughs> he has a little bit of balance issues when he's on his knees with them. But when he stands with them on, he stands way better. I just can't believe how happy he is. This is such good progress. I'm so proud of you, buddy. Yeah, guys, we still haven't put our groceries away. Um, we put, like, the cold stuff away, but everything else is just uh, sitting on the floor. So we should probably do that. Don't you wish he could just, like, put them away for us? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I think he would actually enjoy it, too. He'd think it's fun. Do you remember when you were a kid and you had to, like, do chores like that and you thought they were fun? You were like, yeah, I want to rake the leaves. I'll put the pop away. Yeah. <laughs> I just got out of the shower and I came into the living room. And Leon is still playing with all the groceries. <laughs> Has he been playing with them the whole time I was in the shower? Yeah, I thought he was going to put them in his toy box, but he never did. <laughs> it looks like he's organized them, though. He has, like, the produce over here, the cans over here. And then, like, little containers of stuff right here in the middle. I thought you did that. No, he did that. That's funny. Leon, watch this. I'm going to stack them up. Leon's like, what? <laughs> i tell you what, these yellow cans stack really well, and these blue cans not as much. I think it depends on if they're, like, the same brand. Oh. Look at him. He's amazed. He's like, hold on. You could stack them the whole time? <laughs> Go play with daddy. It's kind of like building a big tower out of cans. <laughs> there you go. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Do you think that's cool? Yeah. You say, he's like, yay, daddy, you did it. <laughs> I told John to get Leon some snacks while he was at the store. And he got him these little Scooby-Doo treats. And I was like, oh, those are cool. What made you pick those? Well, I can tell you never watched Scooby-Doo because they're called Scooby Snacks. Oh, sorry. Gosh. <laughs> and it's funny because he has like this little bowl like it's a dog bowl. And I was going <laughs> to eat dog treats out of his dog bowl. <laughs> it's, look, he's like, can I please have my dog treats? Do you want some Scooby Snacks? Okay. <laughs> I wonder if he'll eat them out of the package, John. Do you think he would? Let's see. Here. Do you see how it's open? Can you reach in there? Get you a Scooby snack, as John says, because apparently I said it wrong. Oh, he did. It does look like a dog treat. Oh my god. That's so funny. It looks like he's... Did he shove the whole thing in his mouth? Buddy! Oh my goodness. You're going to get choked. You have to bite it. Okay, so I broke all of them in half because apparently Leon was going to, like, choke himself. You got it? There you go. There's your Scooby snacks. Well, we had to take the braces off. He was kind of fussing around and kept pointing to them. And when I took them off, he acted like his feet were pretty sore. But he has had them on for about two hours now, which is really impressive. So he's definitely making progress with it. And we are so proud of you. Yeah, we're proud of you, buddy. Yeah. And look, guys, we finally cleaned up our house. We swept and everything. <laughs> And I also wanted to show you, you know, we're perfectly fine now that I made it back home. Like I said, we got at least a week and a half of food. I didn't go crazy. I only really needed one gallon of milk, but everybody bought all the one gallons and there was only half a gallon and I was lucky to get these. So, but Leon needs his milk for his, his blends and his liquids. So just a couple things i would love to get you know um juice <laughs> everybody's buying all the juice to have right and just a, did they even buy like the frozen canned juices no 
Oh, you didn't check those? Oh, no, they were oh. there. I just didn't. I, okay, so that's my fault. <laughs> I am a tiny bit concerned about how much weight these shelves can actually hold. Like this one and this one are fine because it's like lightweight stuff, but this shelf has like a bunch of cans. It looks fine, it's not like dipping or anything like that, but if my dad watches this video and says we have too much weight on it, then we know. <laughs> what do you think? Do you think it's okay? I hope that it is. <laughs> okay. I'm coming to the realization that Leon's face is just like always messy because he eats all day long. I mean, he eats more than me. He does, doesn't yeah, he? Most of the food I got was for him. Yeah. <laughs> all right, guys, I think that we are going to eat some dinner and have a family movie night. How does that sound, buddy? Yeah. <laughs> what do you want to watch? <laughs> Cars? <laughs> yeah, I know. We always gotta watch cars. We've seen it a million times. <laughs> Thankfully there's three cars movies, so I don't get super burnt out on it. But you love it. Oh, okay, he's going. Bye. <laughs> but I guess that is pretty much it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. We'll see you tomorrow. In the next video. Bye. Touch the camera. Bye. <laughs>